Should I turn the camera off? You say he. <laughs> guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Dev be sure to like comment and subscribe down below if you are a returning actually fam member oh welcome back to the family um listen I can explain before anyone starts to come for me I know I've been gone for a really really long time shout out to everyone that was reaching out to me by the way though I had so many people messaging me asking me if I was quitting my YouTube if I was done with social media in general because I just went ghost like I haven't posted on anything in half a year now um, yeah, so I can explain though. <laughs> Listen, I have literally just been going through so, so much. Um, I hope you guys can hear me because I left my microphone at home. But long story short, the reason I just had to disappear for a while is because I was just going through so much stuff from health issues to school and work and just dealing with all of that combined at the same time. Pretty much something had to give. Obviously, I couldn't give up on school. Um, if you don't know, I'm in school for nursing, so I couldn't give up on that. Obviously, I can't give up on work because I have bills to pay. Um, and so pretty much, it just got to the point where like, if I'm not there mentally, there's no way I can provide good content for you guys. So it was like, I had to make a choice, and my choice was to take a break, get myself back together, and come back better for you guys and able to actually have good content. Um, and then also, if you can't hear, I am struggling with my speech. It has been so bad lately, and if you watch my older videos, I kind of talked about it a little bit. Pretty much, my wisdom teeth are super, super awful. I'm actually getting them out in a couple of days. Finally, getting them out in a couple of days, um, and then I can start to get my speech back together. If you can't hear, I can hear it. It's very annoying, and part of the reason I stopped filming is because I couldn't stand to hear myself talk. Like, I just, I could not stand to hear myself talk. Once my wisdom teeth are out, they'll be able to realign my jaw with a visaline and that should fix the speech problem that I'm having because right now I just sound so gross so sloppy and like slurred almost and like I have a really bad lisp that I've developed I'm sure you can hear it trust me I know it's annoying for me to hear it just as much as it's annoying for you to hear it but we're working on it but yeah so I am currently on my way to the mall I'm heading to Somerset Mall and I need to just finish up a little bit of Christmas shopping I honestly didn't start Christmas shopping until like a couple days ago which is really bad but I just have a few more gifts to get and yeah so we're on our way to the mall right now and plus on top of Christmas shopping I have actually been doing really good with school despite all the health issues and being in and out of the hospital for all my surgeries and stuff like that I actually ended this semester with a 4.0 so I'm going to the mall to not only do a little bit of Christmas shopping but to treat myself to something nice um, maybe a few nice things maybe I don't know yet but we'll see when we get there I don't know if they will let me film when I get inside the mall. I know that some stores are kind of strict on that. So I will try to vlog as much content as I can. Okay, so we just got to the mall and I'm just gonna rant real quick. Um, child, not this mall being packed. I mean, I did this to myself. It is the first week of Christmas. The first week of Christmas. It's the week of Christmas. Like, what was I expecting? But I'm thinking in my mind, let me just, let me just tell you my thought process. I understand that it's the week of Christmas, but I'm thinking, you know, it's Tuesday. It's not even quite three o'clock yet. People might still, you know, be at work. So I should be able to get in here and get out. <laughs> Girl, this mall is packed and I don't do well with crowds. And <laughs> another annoying thing, I only have this blue surgical mask, which is really freaking annoying because I switched bags and my black mask is in my other bag and I was gonna do the whole black on black thing but now I'm just gonna have to wear this blue mask which is unfortunate but we're about to go into the mall okay so I was not able to find much of what I was looking for I was looking for three particular things um, one of them was this really pretty YSL scarf that I have been seeing um, Aaliyah wear and if you don't know who Aaliyah is I'm talking about Aaliyah's face she's literally my favorite freaking youtuber ever she literally gives me so much inspiration and motivation to just keep going like when I was going through that little bottle of depression for those six months I just watched her every single day and like literally just gave me the inspiration that I needed to just get back to what I was doing anyways that was like totally off topic I was able to find everything that I wanted um I wasn't able to find that YSL scarf or this Dior necklace I've been looking for I was however able to find these boots I have been wanting for so long unfortunately they did not have my size uh, my size is very popular and so it was sold out but 
I was able to order them. So I'm so excited for them to come in. I cannot wait for them to come in. I have been dying for these boots. I have been dying, dying, dying for these boots. I can't wait for them to come in. So yeah, I'm gonna reveal what boots I got when I do my collective haul. Um, <laughs> child, I'm out of breath. I like ran, <laughs> I like ran back to my car um, because I was like lost. I came out the wrong door. And so I was like looking for my car in the parking lot and I couldn't find it. So then I realized I was on the wrong side. So I ran all the way through the parking lot to get to my car. So I'm out of breath. <laughs> Let's try again. Anyways, I cannot wait for these boots to come in. I'm so excited. I am going to do a collective haul, so that's when I'm gonna like reveal what boots I got. If you follow me on my social media though, you might see them before this vlog goes up. Uh, by the way, if you don't follow me on my social media, make sure you do. I'll have them linked somewhere on the screen. Um, I feel like I'm going to pass out and I have a very bad headache. Um, and then I remember that I have not had a single thing to eat all day long. Like it is four o'clock now and I haven't had anything to eat so um also don't mind the mess in the back i have the yeah there's a mess in the back yeah anyways okay so i just got back home from the mall and i just finished eating um i really hope that this quality uh the sound quality is not gonna be bad i have no clue where i put my microphone at um i literally don't know so i really hope that the sound quality is gonna be bad and i hope you guys can hear me um it's, like that's how long it's been since i've like picked up my camera i have no clue where anything is so i'm gonna have to find that um but honestly i need a new microphone anyway so I might go buy a new one. Anyways, I just got home and a package came and I am so excited. I have a package from Pretty Little Thing um, and I'm so excited to open it. Um, I'm still waiting on another package from Pretty Little Thing, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and open this one for you guys and try um, some of these things on. I really don't remember what I ordered, so I'm actually excited to see what I ordered. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try some of this stuff on uh, for a cute little mini haul in this little vlog here that we got going on. I feel like this lighting is really bad. I don't like this lighting. Anyways, I'm gonna go try this stuff on. Um, yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so these are the first couple pieces I tried on and I'm really living for these pants right here. I just wish that they actually fit me. Like, like there's so much room in there. Um, so yeah, I mean, I guess I could get them taken in. Um, but they're still giving everything that I feel like they need to give. They are definitely a huge vibe to me. Like, they're just, they're just a vibe. Like, I don't know, I picture these on, like, vacation or something. Um, and I would say vacation only because these pants are very, very thin. I was not expecting them to be that thin. But they are, like, paper thin. They're still really cute, though. They still give everything they need to give. But these are definitely, like, a summer, springtime type pants. Like I said, probably, like, a vacation type thing. And then I got this really cute chocolate-colored basic tank top. I feel like having these type of little pieces in your wardrobe are just essential because they can go with literally everything. I was really excited to try on these next pieces, but <laughs> let's just talk about it. This top looks absolutely nothing like, absolutely nothing like what I thought it would. Um, it, <laughs> I mean, uh, the pants on the other hand, the pants are not necessarily the worst thing in the world. Um, they looked cuter online for sure. Um, it's supposed to be like a chocolate color, but I feel like it's more, I don't know, like maroony almost. I feel like it's not super chocolate. Like you guys ever order something and you just seriously like cannot wait to put it on and then you put it on and it's just, it gives nothing that it's supposed to give. I mean, I feel like if I finessed it a little bit, cause I'm really good at like finessing, um, like an outfit, like I'll finesse the outfit real quick. <laughs> but I feel like maybe if I finessed it a little bit, I could pull it off. But right now I'm just, <sighs> I don't know. Okay, so besides the fact that it took me literally 35 minutes to figure out how to put this shirt on, um, I feel like this is kind of a redeeming moment compared to the last shirt that we just tried on. I, I'm really obsessed with the shirt. I am obsessed. I feel like it's, it's, this is a moment. We are redeemed <laughs> compared to that last top that we just had on. Um, okay, so this last one that I have to show you guys is, it's cute. It's cute. Uh, it's just not what I was going for exactly when I read the description and said that it was an oversized crew neck. But, um, this is giving very much so fitted, which is not like the most terrible thing. Like I said, it's still very cute, casual, just something to like kind of lounge in or just throw on really quickly. Um, I just wish that it was more oversized. Like it's not, it's not giving oversized to me. It's giving more so just kind of like 
fitted. Um, although when Molly Mae was wearing it on uh, the Pretty Little Liars website, Pretty Little Liars, <laughs> on the Pretty Little Thing website, it was super like baggy, oversized, like gigantic on her. So I'm like wondering what size she must have ordered because oversized where? Where is the oversized? <laughs> Hey guys, it is currently the next day um, after I got finished filming that haul for a pretty little thing or not for a pretty little thing, but for a pretty little thing. Um, I ended up just doing my night routine and going to bed. So it is now uh, the next day. It is what day is it? It is Wednesday, the 22nd. I officially get my wisdom teeth out tomorrow. Um, also, this this lighting is absolutely trash. So I but I'm getting ready to leave anyway. So, um, yeah, ignore the lighting. But really quick, I just want to show you guys my outfit. <laughs> I just jumped around to like five different subjects. Forgive me. Um, I get my wisdom to that tomorrow. I've been up since like 2 a.m. <laughs> um, I've had a productive morning though. I've had a really, really productive morning. Um, I don't know why I woke up at 2 a.m. My body just decided to wake up. Uh, I tried laying there for hours to go back to sleep. Could not fall back asleep. So here we are. But like I said, I've had a productive morning. Um, I filmed an entire YouTube video. Um, I filmed a Fashion Nova haul, which is actually where I got this jacket from. But that's why I want to show you guys my outfit. So <laughs> firstly, I'm going to show you guys my jacket. Um, it's this really cute oversized Fashion Nova jacket that I just opened up today. And then I'm wearing some tan boots that I got from Fashion Nova as well. Uh, jeans also from Fashion Nova. Can you guys see it? Hopefully you guys can. Uh, jeans also from Fashion Nova. This bodysuit is from Pretty Little Thing. Uh, but yeah, I need to get going. My sister is waiting for me. We're going to head to brunch. I need to stop by CVS first to pick up my medication. I still have to go pick up my new phone today. Um, still got to go to the mall, give my little brother his Christmas gift. So I got to get going. Uh, I'll probably catch back up with you guys, pick you guys back up in the car maybe or at breakfast. Hey guys, so a couple things. Um, really quickly, I realized the way I just kind of said I'm going to go get my medication uh, was a little bit weird just to elaborate a little bit um i have been going through a lot of health issues that's part of the reason why i have not been uh filming at all for my channel or just posting at all on social media um also i found my microphone i found i found it in a i, I get so sidetracked really easily i found my microphone um it was in a bag that i took um on the airplane when i went to mexico that's how long i have not used my camera or my microphone so i finally found it so my audio should sound a little bit better uh but anyways i kind of was like really all over the place when i was talking about my medication my health issues i just don't want people to get like super worried or like i don't know just have just take it the wrong way or something like that but pretty much i have been dealing with a lot of health issues um particularly with my gallbladder and my stomach uh without going into too much detail because some of the things i just kind of you know i want to keep to myself or keep personal or whatever um i do have to get my gallbladder removed uh because homegirl is just not working at all and this mama's just decided to go on a permanent vacation um so i do have to get it removed pretty much the way i found out is that i was getting sick every single time i ate and like something obviously wasn't right um so i went to the doctor and they did a bunch of tests i was in and out of the hospital for so long just trying to do a bunch of tests to figure out what exactly was going on finally found out that according to my doctor the normal gallbladder for someone around my age should be processing and working anywhere between 80 to 100 <laughs> percent mine is at 18 percent so homegirl just isn't working at all so that's like the medication that i have been on just so people don't you know take the whole i'm getting medication the wrong way so yeah but once i get it removed um i still won't be able to like go back to normal i have to completely change the way my diet is which isn't the worst thing in the world because to be honest if if you know me and if you watch my previous stuff and just like anyone who knows me in real life knows that i would eat whatever i wanted to i didn't care if it was super processed i didn't care if it was pretty much anything i, I would eat anything i love sweets i love a whole bunch of cheesy pasta -y, all the bad stuff for you i loved it all so i pretty much have to completely do a 180 with my diet i'm being forced to now eat better which is actually you know not a bad thing i should have been doing that a long time ago um no that's not the reason my gallbladder stopped working according to the doctor there is no known reason why your gallbladder stops working so i don't want people to assume that um oh uh oh oh shit. um but um sorry there's like a car stuck in the middle of the road but um anyways i'm almost to my mom's house which is where my sister is and she's going to drive uh to the brunch spot that we're going to i hope i thought that they closed at a certain time it is 12 o'clock and i feel like they close at two 
so but she called me late she called me like 11 30 next if i wanted to go here so technically it's not my fault um this lighting is absolutely trash has it been trash this whole entire time anyways um i'll just check it back in with you guys later this car is riding my like why we can't go anywhere and the speed limit is a certain speed limit so why absolutely fucking why and it's a fee is that a female yes yeah, a f female of course female no offense some of y'all need y'all licenses re revoked like I, I i don't understand why some of you how some of you got your license but i'm the one that's vlogging and driving anyways i'll check back in with you guys um when i get to my sister <laughs> Auntie, got you, Auntie. Say hi, Charlie. Say hi, Charlie. She's like a black ball right now. <laughs> Say hi, Charlie. Hi, Charlie. It's Auntie Baby. It's Auntie Baby. Let me see your face. Let me see your face. Let me see it. Oh, they oh, are. They do. We get the camera no cool. She wants to match my coat. <laughs> we didn't plan this. We didn't plan this at all. <laughs> Look at my mom's Christmas tree. Look how cute it is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that one's mine. I'm like 99% sure that one's mine. A wall mirror like my mom has in her house. If I had this type of mirror in my house, I would not know how to act. <laughs> this is a must for when me and Tristan finally get a house. But I can show you guys my outfit better now. <laughs> I love my mom's house specifically for this reason. Specifically for this reason. But yeah, today's outfit. Um, and this is, I didn't show you guys my bag that I'm carrying. This is my coach bag uh, that I'm carrying with my outfit. Uh, just a plain black bag. And I didn't show you guys my rings either. Uh, this is my Savorsky ring that I bought myself. This is a Disney Pandora ring that Tristan bought me. Um, it's a Cinderella one. And then on this hand is the uh, Minnie and Mickey Disney Pandora Fiddle Focus ring that I got. I'm ready to go though, I'm starving. Uh, doesn't this place close at two? Uh, three. Oh, okay. Cause I did not want to be those people. They bring out the food really fast. Okay, hopefully it's not busy. Move, Charlie. This could be my first time getting in your Jeep. Really? Yeah. Look at my sister's Jeep. Well, I don't want to show you guys where my mom lives, so I'll wait. Someone I know. Who? Wanted to go with me. Should I turn the camera off? You say he. Yeah, it's not like that, though. Oh, okay. I didn't toast, uh, test drove a Jeep before I got my uh, RT, and... It was too noisy for me, but I drove an older version. She has like the 2021 version, so she has like a touchscreen and all that in her car. Um, and it actually is less noisy than the one that I test drove. It's not bad. It's roomy as hell too. Had a lot of leg room. Okay, son, way to mess up the picture. Anyways, I'll check back in with you guys when we get to the uh, brunch lunch or brunch breakfast spot that we're going to back at the mall i was literally just here yesterday but we are back at the mall again um we just need to find something for my little brother trying to shop for a guy is honestly really hard but um we're gonna see what we can find i wasn't able to find anything yesterday i only bought something for myself so we're actually gonna try to um find something for our little brother and yeah so we're about to go to summertime mall it's way more packed than it was yesterday so i had no right complaining yesterday because it's actually way more packed today but i mean it's christmas so yeah we're about to go into this mall i don't know how much i'm gonna be able to vlog because i think some stores don't really let you vlog like i said yesterday but we'll see how much footage i get um yeah all right we're about to go in here so i was just here yesterday and um i'm back again <laughs> So she just got herself a nice bag and I was gonna get a bag that was inside of there but I wanted to come over to the store I was just at yesterday. I'm supposed to be here shopping for my little brother and um, we're kind of failing at that right now. <laughs> so yeah, we'll see if I can find um, a bag. I've been honestly just wanting a bag and now that she just bought one, it makes me want to get one even more. Uh, we're kind of failing at shopping right now. Yeah. Hello. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, Devin. Are you looking for anything? Yeah, yeah. Uh, shopping, but a bag yeah. in particular. Thank you. This line is wrapped around the freaking, um, this is a bad angle, especially with my hair pulled back, but oh well. This line is wrapped around the damn corner of this damn store. I waited in line 30 minutes. 30 minutes yesterday, I waited in line to get into the store. Hopefully it doesn't take that long today, but it looks the same length that it was yesterday, so we might. Okay, so we totally didn't get the stuff that we were supposed to get. Um, uh, this was not, that was not supposed to happen. Um, I blame her. <laughs> but we are now almost done shopping, I think. Well, I am, because this was not supposed to happen. Um, so yeah. Hey guys, um, I am extremely, extremely exhausted. I just got back home finally. Um, I'm, I'm tired. <laughs> I feel like we've been gone all day long. Plus I've been up since two o'clock this morning um, and we were at the mall I feel like for hours. Um, we did finally end up finding my little brother um, the diamond earrings that he wanted from Tappers or Tapers. I really don't know how to pronounce that store, but uh, me and my sister got him those and then we also kind of spoiled ourselves just a little bit and Honestly, my bank account is going to hate me so much, but after Christmas, it'll be better after Christmas I'm going on a literally I'm going on a no spending Spree no spending at all <laughs> um, My bank account is going to hate me this holiday, but it was worth it for my family and then just a couple gifts that I got myself personally. Um, so yeah, um, I'm exhausted. I'm about to go inside. Tristan is finally home. Um, so we're probably... Oh, we have to go to the grocery store. Alright, maybe we'll do... I know I get my wisdom teeth out tomorrow, so I can't even do it tomorrow. Um, Alright, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> um, I don't know if I'm going to vlog for the rest of the day. Um, I'm, I'm exhausted and I don't know. I don't know either i'll see you guys sometime later today or i'll see you guys tomorrow i am going to be vlogging my wisdom teeth being removed but that's going to be its own separate video entirely so um that'll be posted probably after this vlog or sometime then um not my forehead being extremely shiny gosh my makeup it's time for this makeup to come off um but yeah, um, that is kind of it. I will see you guys either later tonight or if not tomorrow, maybe I'll vlog a little bit on Christmas Eve with my family. I don't know if I want this vlog though to be that long or how I want to end this vlog. We'll see though. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know. But uh, I'll check back in with you guys. We'll find out when. Bye.